column just passed by. Uh, this is Moorhead City, North Carolina. They port here, so it's good to see them. They got gunners up in the uh, in the turrets. They must be doing some training. And there they are. Hurrah, Marines! But this man right here is why I'm coming out here. This is the first time I've actually ever I've been able to get a hold of this guy. <laughs> I've been meaning to come down here and share a good word with him for quite some time. Finally here with my friend Bill. He's from, where are you from, Bill? I've been here 17 years. I'm from Erie, Pennsylvania. Spent 57 years up there. What did you do? Uh, I, I, worked, I worked for Siemens up there. But, okay. Uh, in the 80s, I was in. I took a leap of absence when things got slow. Right. As a police officer in Columbia, South Carolina. Oh, right on. So, right on. I'm, I'm a 12-year Marine veteran myself. I got a, got I was, a lot of love I was for in my... the Marine Corps. Right. Now I'm going to get my age away. Oh, right. 67, 68. 67. When, so you were in from 67, 68? Yeah, I was in Vietnam. For what, wow, months. wow. What did you do? So uh, what was your job over there? Infantry. Infantry? So I, I Yeah, I started out in the infantry, and then I went over to counterintelligence. And, uh, you know, we love our country. That's what it's all about. Yeah. Bill is out here. He comes out. This is the first day I've had a chance to get out here and talk to him. And he's out here just flying... That good back the blue flag. We've got another flag over there for support of uh, firefighters and police officers. So I just, even as I came up to you, Bill, I said, right. "Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the sons of God." Yes. So tell the people a little bit about what drove you to come out here today. Just what's happened over the last year, year and a half in America to our police officers being attacked, some injured, some have died, and very few people held accountable for their actions and. Uh, I'm just out here to show my support for our heroes in blue and red and just let them know I have their back. You know, and uh, that's so important. I was just saying before, too, uh, the way the country is today, it's almost like the police are even afraid. Oh, they, don't, they don't have support to enforce the law. It's a shame what's happened to our police officers. That's why I'm out here. Well, God bless, my brother. I really, I really thank, thank you for taking Zach. your time. It's been a pleasure. Thank you. And thank you for sharing your story with everybody. Any, I really appreciate it. Anytime, anytime. And uh, I'll, always, uh, I'll always support our police. I'll always support our military. You see the military column going by. Yes. I haven't seen them back here in a while. So. Yes. But God bless you all. Semper Fi, hallelujah, and amen. Semper Fi, back to blue. Hoorah! Back to blue and you're heroes.